Up next, it's a flyweight title fight between Valentina Shevchenko and Lauren Murphy. All right, so here she is, the UFC Women's Flyweight contender looking to become the new champion here tonight. There is no denying she has every tool and every skill you could want, and she has all the makings of a UFC champion. Let's see if the pressure gets to her here tonight, or if she can put forth a similar performance that, of course, has led to this monumental opportunity here tonight. All right, so here she is, the UFC Women's Flyweight Champion, all smiles as she makes the walk here tonight, looking to go out the way she came in as the undisputed champion at 125 pounds. Most people believe it is gonna take a huge effort from one of these fellow contender types to dethrone this UFC Women's Flyweight Champion. Let's see how she does in this defense here tonight. All right, almost ready to go with this one. Here is tonight's tale of the tape. So a more than five-year gap between these two fighters when it comes to the age, with similar height and the same reach. Here is Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. When the action begins, our referee in charge of the octagon, Eve LeVay. This is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the MGM Grand Garden Arena in Las Vegas, it's time! Five rounds for the undisputed UFC Flyweight Championship of the world. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This woman is a mixed martial artist holding a professional record of 15 wins, four losses. She stands five feet seven inches tall, weighing in at 125 pounds. Fighting out of Glendale, Arizona, USA, presenting the challenger, Lauren Murphy. And now, Introducing the champion, fighting out of the red corner. This woman is a Muay Thai fighter, holding a professional record of 21 wins, three losses. She stands five feet five inches tall, weighing in at 125 pounds. Fighting out of Ishkek, Kyrgyzstan, presenting the reigning, defending, undisputed UFC flyweight champion of the world. UFC belt on the line, protect yourself at all time, obey my command at all time. If you want to touch love, do it now, go back to your corner. They touch him up, and we are underway. striking specialist is that you have to be up When you're facing a full-on mixed martial artist, expect the level change we're going to see what type of improvement she's made in terms of defending herself in those wrestling situations. All right, she postures up here, DC. We'll see if she can get those ground strikes. Watch for the huge elbows that she's known for. 
half guard position for her here. And if you're the bottom fighter, this is truly a case of, of pick your poison. Yeah, you gotta pick your poison. And if you're on the bottom, you gotta be trying to find a way to escape that bottom leg. You cannot allow your opponent, you cannot allow her to sit on your leg and just throw big damage and strikes. You've got to make sure you're on an elbow control, an underhook, and getting back to your feet. Good stick. Nice takedown land. Also, the wrestling jumps on display there. Shevchenko changes course and takes the fight to the ground. But we've seen this. We've seen Valentina mix it up. We saw it against Juliana Pena. We thought she was gonna have to keep that fight standing. But before we knew it, the fight was over by submission. Valentina Shevchenko is as good a mixed martial artist as we have in the UFC. So just over 20 total strikes have now landed for Valentina Shevchenko. Murphy's knee to the body is blocked. Well, she's been good tonight, but she missed without it. Now she's got the Muay Thai plum. Real quick leg kick. Trying to go for the single leg takedown. Doesn't get it. Look at the control of the posture as he land that knee. Jeff Chaka. Whoa! She is such a diverse striker that that big strike landed, and it looks like she's going to finish this fight. Stuff the takedown, no problem. All right, both women now continuing to try to get a more dominant position here in the clinch. I can hear Dominic Cruz just screaming underhooks. My ears are bleeding a little bit. Yeah, underhook, underhook, underhook. It's the key in that position. You gotta control the underhook to win offensively and control the underhook in another takedown land. There is just a viciousness with which she operates here on the ground as she continues to get the ground and pound game going. She might get a finish here. She's looking for a finish. She's so good at dictating the ground stages and she's doing a fantastic job of building posture to try to land that kill shot at the top. Under two minutes to go on the round. Ooh, uppercut lands. We'll see where she goes from here now. Mixes it up nicely in terms of staying heavy and also staying active. If you're in the clinch, you can pull down on the head and land a few punches to the head. So again, they will press you. Inside trip there. Oh, that was nice. Oh, well played there as she gets back to her feet. Man, she might punch harder than you. Nice connection there. Ah, I don't know about that, John, but she is a fast, accurate striker. Oh, and there's another leg kick. Just out, right? I mean, now she has sort of rendered her opponent, as you see the damage, a, a one-legged fighter. She is fighting a one-legged fighter, a wounded gazelle right in front of her. Right. Oh, this can change the fight. Another takedown land. Well, she was long on grappling experience coming into the UFC, and you see her chops here. Just beautiful when it comes to the transition game. It's very difficult to keep up with her on the ground. Murphy gets back up again. Nicely done. Look at the turtle in that kick. Shevchenko's head kick is blocked. I think she hurt. Now connects with a right. All right, so there it is again. Another sprawl, beautiful takedown defense. Everybody in this division is going to be trying to take her down, but tonight, unable to do so. When you're as good of a striker as she is, people are going to want to wrestle with you. She has really done a good job of rounding out her takedown defense, using it to sprawl and brawl and get back to her feet. All right, let us now check out some of the action from that round, DC, and what a display of striking for her. Yeah, she did a fantastic job of finding her spots, putting herself in position where she was the one landing and really dictating the pace of the fight. She did a great job of mixing up everything to get in control. You ready? You ready? Fight. Second round underway. 
big punch lands through the middle. You got to check these low leg kicks. Well, there's no denying her power. She has been pretty accurate here tonight, but she's the type of fighter when she goes to the drive through window. She's just getting stuck. You can never know what you're going to see with this young lady. Is she going to finish the fight? Well, she's been good tonight, but she missed with that. Way to hide that leg. Oh, big left hook there. Oh, what a punch. Murphy's uppercut is blocked. What a fantastic wrestler. Great takedown. Man, she is just non-stop on the ground, moving in all the right directions. Another nice transition by her there. She's moving a lot, but every movement has purpose. Good ground and pound by her here. She felt like she could finish the fight with her ground strikes tonight and might be well on her way here. I mean, John, I believe it after watching the ground and pound that she's landing in this part of the fight. And she's back up again, so the takedowns have been there. So have the get-ups. Big head kick land. Oh, big punch land. Leg kick checked nicely by Murphy. Man, she can hardly stand now. And if she was a step behind before when she was fresh, how do you think she feels now that she's barely able to step on that leg? Well, she's got a good jab. Miss with it there. Well, she was a little bit hesitant in round one, but she has certainly picked up the pace here in this second round. It took her a while to find her range. She's in a strong striking rhythm now. Nice punch, man, over the top. Man, her striking looks clean tonight. Timing on point. Her timing's on point. Her accuracy's on point. She's very busy. She's in a good flow. is blocked, no damage there. Big kick lands. All right, so once again, they will clinch, and we will see which fighter is able to advance their position for them. Who's gonna be the first one to attempt the takedown? Both of our combatants have the ability to score and secure the position. Whoa! Can't take pictures now. She has to react, she has to go chase the finish. in and secures the takedown. Nice right hand. Oh, nice job by her there. You see how strong she is. Her opponent's trying to control posture, unable to do so. Now she can get to work and put the money in the bank with that ground and pound. Money in the bank. And she caught the kick. Murphy gets touched by that kick there. Trying to hammer that lead leg. Lands the right hand. The cardio you must have in order to secure this many takedown. Back to the feet now. Look at the force behind that leg kick. Oh, she is as relentless as any striker on this roster, man or woman, eternally aggressive with her strikes. Gotta be careful, of course, not to gas out, but so far, so good for her here in this round. And she connects with a punch there. We'll see if she can follow it up now. What a beautiful takedown. Shevchenko gets the single leg takedown. Nicely done there. Ooh, how about that reversal by her there, champ? That is a fantastic transition by this young lady. What a job. bad spot on the ground and you want to reverse it, that's what you need to do. Master class in changing position, unreal to see. Well, the grounded pound is there once again. Strong work here by Shevchenko. Oh, now she's got that tight clinch. Appreciable damage could be coming. Plus right hand is true.
right, so she's making her way back to the stool. Kind of shaking her head. Thought maybe that knockdown would have produced a finish. Not so much. She's a little discouraged right now because she thought the fight was over. But if you know her, if you spent any time with her, you understand that she's a smart fighter. And she will get right back to doing what she needs to do to win this fight. Here we go, third round of this championship fight. It's such a fast leg kick. All right, so she continues to land a high number of strikes here, just like she did in the previous round. As efficient as any striker in the division, this is a world-class display of striking here tonight. Shevchenko gets caught with that punch. Wow. How good is her movement here on the ground, right? Shades of Ray Moore just transitioning so beautifully. Yeah, she's so good at transitions and movement. Her ability is unmatched. Well, there are a few things more fun to watch in mixed martial arts than these type of transitions and scrambles on the ground. High-level grappling can really be entertaining. Murphy gets up and is back on her feet. Very nice. Nice leg kick lands. Oh, nice elbow. Nice punch lands. Oh, she's got the right hand going tonight, DC. She's in a great flow, and she's throwing from her dominant side to land that great strike. Well, she ain't cocky, but she is confident, and why not? Big knockdown in the previous round. She appears to have the strike in the advantage. She's doing everything right. That's what led her to get in that knockdown to finish earlier round. Timing her shots nicely here tonight, DC. She's doing a great job, but not only being active, she is so accurate. She's on point tonight. Oh, nice shot to the body, connects for her there. Somewhat surprising, we didn't see a lot of body work from her earlier in the fight, but she is getting after it now. Oh, that's a hell of a kick by her there. We'll see if she can follow it up now, champ. Great job landing that kick. Beautiful body kick lands right under the elbow. Man, the body work really starting to take its toll here. Obvious redness on that right side. Takedown defense holds up. Nice loop and punch. Leg kick checked effectively there by Murphy. Well, she lands another strike to the body here, and the percentage is getting high now in terms of the body strikes landed. Didn't see a lot of that earlier on, making up for lost time here. I mean, look at the commitment to kicking in this fight. Counterpunch landed there by Murphy. Leg kick. What a punch. Well, she went to the straight left, unable to connect them. DC, for my money, she's really timing her shots pretty well here tonight. Her timing, accuracy, and also the activity level is great tonight. Oh, she caught the kick. Well, this is exactly the sense of urgency you'd want to see from her here. She's trying to keep the judges out of it, really lighten her up now. Oh, and she connects there, so the hands look good tonight. Great time to land that punch. Stuffs the takedown shot there. How good is her takedown be? Nice leg kick. She blocked the punch. She, oh. she is such a diverse striker. That dad big strike landed, and it looks like she's going to finish this fight. <laughs> Beautiful leg kick throw. Able to check the high kick. Stuffs the takedown, no problem. Nice stick to the body. Way to mix up the car. 
30 seconds now to go on the round. Ooh, big shot land. Murphy fights her. She finally gets the takedown. It wasn't for any lack of effort earlier on, but cleaned up the technique a little bit. And now we'll see what she can do. She cleaned it up. She really did take her time back. She took a step back. She evaluated what's my best course of action. Figured it out. Got it done. Now, how does she handle being on top with dominant top positions? Murphy's lower jaw does not look good. I don't think it's broken, but starting to show some obvious signs of swelling. All right, so there's the horn. The round is over, and we've got more fighting. It looked like maybe we'd get a finish there after she landed upstairs. Well, she was excited. She thought it was done. How does she reshift? How does she get herself back in the moment to try to repeat what she just did, but also top it and actually get the finish? All right, here we go. Fourth round of a possible Ready? five is now Ready? underway, and now is the time, DC, where the endurance, the cardio... Oh! That one landed clean. Combinations here. Big knee to the body. Try to establish that jab. And a nice job at least staying upright on that. Good one. And both fighters exchange in the pocket. Oh, she just continues to land a high volume of strikes here, really just like she did in the previous round. And she does not seem to be slowing down at all. There's no tell on that leg kick. Looks as though her leg might be hurt here, limping a little bit. forward with a left there. Oh, nice job by her to posture up there. Now we'll see if she can maintain that separation. She has to recognize that her opponent will start trying to squirrel away now. Beautiful level change. Lisa to take that. Well, pretty good work off of the bottom here by Murphy. All right, she postures up here, DC. We'll see if she can get those ground strikes. Going. Watch for the... Shevchenko's looking for that arm triangle now. A triangle, a triangle. I need you to fight out of that. Oh, nice job, Bob. Nicely done. Shevchenko's looking for that arm triangle. Shevchenko's looking for that arm triangle now. Watch triangle, watch triangle. Watch your neck. Oh, we're getting a finish here. Nicely done. She postures up here, DC. We'll see if she can get those ground strikes. Here. Watch for the huge elbows that she's known for. Look at the torso on the right side. Major bruising, and it's only getting worse. Great punch. Some nice back and forth action here. Nice defense there. Single leg attempt, no good. Over. You come up, you go down. Another takedown land. Oh, nice strike on the ground for her. Oh, and with urgency, she is back up again. I'm not sure her striking has ever looked better, DC. Finding the range with relic. Oh! You can never know what you're gonna see with this young lady. Is she gonna finish the fight? 
Shevchenko squad. Can't take pictures now. She has to react. She has to go chase the finish. Now goes in and secures the takedown. Oh, nice job by her there. You see how strong she is. Her opponent's trying to control posture, unable to do so. Now she can get the work and put the money in the bank with that ground and pound. Money in the bank. Shevchenko's back in half court. Well, you gotta try to stay busy off of your back. She's doing it here. Nice punch. 30 seconds to go. She's going back to that bat. This straight right hand, unable to connect. Nice kick. Oh, yeah, right hand. Oh, my goodness. So she holds on. You get up, you go down as another kick down the tip leg. Oh, spinning back fist out of nowhere. In a very close round, a takedown like that might be the difference. All right, so a standing ovation from this capacity crowd after that round. A huge knockdown there in the middle of the round. Got to have her feeling pretty good here as she goes through the Back and forth up to that point. But she eventually found the shot that put her opponent on her backside. But how about the toughness of oh. the opponent to get up off the floor and finish that round? Let's see how she approaches the next round. All right, so the big moment in that previous round was the knockdown. We'll get to the replay now. DC, take us through it. She was able to get her chance. She was able to find her moment. She recognized that an opportunity presented itself. She took it and landed that beautiful knockdown. Oh, man, head kick land. Ooh, what a punch. Well, a combination lands for her there. It's hard to recall a past fight of hers in which her striking has looked this fluid and good. She's sharp as attack. Sharp as a tack. Everything is landing. She's doing a great job. Nice body kick right under the elbow. Murphy's lower jaw does not look good. I'm not sure it could be any more swollen. She continues to fight through. Nice entry into the finish direct. Nice job by her there to reverse the position on the ground. She was in trouble. Now she is the one handing out the punishment. Great change of position very quickly. Shevchenko gets back up. Good side for her there. Spinning back fist is there. Nice kick. So maybe that one gets her attention. Well, she said in these situations she had to protect her head, and defensively she has done an outstanding job of it. She could not do She's her bad. Oh! <laughs> Just a slip there. Oh, the damage to that leg starting to take its toll. You see her limping a little bit. Oh! You can never know what you're gonna see with this young lady. Is she gonna finish the fight? And just like that, the fight is over! If you're trying to send a message to the rest of this division, that is how you send it. So a near-perfect shot for her to end the fight. She had this crowd behind her all night long. And I'm not sure how many other fighters in this division could have absorbed that strike and stayed in the fight. A near-perfect land to get the knockout win here tonight. All right, we take a look back at some of the pictures from this one, and she had it all going on tonight, but certainly her boxing was on point. Her boxing always is what allows her to dictate the pace of fights. Finally, she landed the strike that ended the night of her opponent. The official decision is Ladies in. And gentlemen, Here's referee, Bruce Buffett. The has called a stop to this contest at two minutes of round number five. Declaring the winner by knockout, Valentina Bullet Shevchenko. All right, so another number one contender goes by the boards. Congratulations to the still UFC flyweight champion of the world. And I would think a scary proposition to the rest of this division. She's only getting better. She is getting better with every single title defense. You knew 
that she would have to be on her game tonight, and she was exactly that to remain the champion.